boy. Twins. Twins. Oh man, that's a big mess. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Getting ready to head to another doctor's appointment for this young lady. We got things to do, busy day. <laughs> at least busy we could, day. At least we can be outside, enjoy the vitamin D and the fresh air. But In Jesus' name. And we running what? We run a tad bit late. I mean, but to be late is to be on time. <laughs> right. Yeah, right. <laughs> Around y'all to be on time is to be late and to be early is to be on time. So we just wanted a tad bit behind, but that's right. okay. So in Jesus' name, we're gonna make it there with safe travel and mercy. And we get to see our midwife and get a little laugh and joke and then yes. run out of there because we in time. We have to we got a lot of things to do. We got something else to do in uh right after. <laughs> so we wanna be in there 20 minutes. So hopefully we get in and out. Lord. But see you when we get there. Bye. Right. Bless you. <laughs> do do it. Put that one out real quick. Hang on and restart. Okay. I'm so sorry. So where have you been feeling uh, baby You just said her just enough. <laughs> so I don't actually know the facts. I'm about to say her. We I mean, actually. She always does that. Well, the last no, two. The last, the last time. The last two clients we've had have had have been pregnant with. Baby girls. So I will tell you, I don't know. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. She, that's what she does. She won't look. Now she's not. Maybe she's just making these predictions. Now she's not. She's done looking over this way. She she stops looking over here. She'll start looking at the student. But we were at the first ultrasound, and the lady was so sweet. You know, she was very nice. She had me mad. So what do you have at home? We said five girls and two boys. Oh, hello, baby. Just that. a whole kid. Like, boom, boom. Just right. like that. And I was like, God, I think God really knows we need another boy. She says, well, I think God tells you you need another girl. Oh. Really? I was like, oh, my God. Is that right? Are you on your back? Oh, that's right. Yeah, the look. I have to look at it too. Okay, it's, well, it's as your uterus grows, it's just with your uterus. But it implants into the uterus, right. so it doesn't like. <laughs> Two ultrasounds in and we don't got it? Right. right. <laughs> Stick a fork in it. That's so we're. We're so focused on the chin Right. <laughs> okay, there you go. Thank you. Hand up. Okay. Thank you, yeah. And then I'll hold this up so you can get it. Few moments later. Just stopped at Publix to get me something to eat. My wife is in the car. I was just over here, boaching. Excuse me, guys. <laughs> we just finished eating. We went to our doctor's appointment. Then we went to go take care of some more business that we had to take care of, y'all. We just got a snack. Then we, to get another snack. <laughs> we just had a Publix wrap. Oh my goodness, veggie wrap. Listen, is it me? It could be that I'm just pregnant, but I, I am so dis indecisive when it comes to what am I going to eat. And then you, and then you just want to eat muffin. Right. So anything my husband orders tastes better than mine, whatever that may be. I promise you, I can order the best meal on the on the menu. His food will notoriously taste better, look better, be more hotter. I mean, it's just everything. So I was like, you know what? 
you go order the food. I don't even know what I want. Just order and I'll just take a bite of yours. He said, what do you want? I said, I don't want nothing. Sure enough, he came out with his food and gave it to me and that thing was amazing. So we split that. Veggie wrap, I don't eat meat anymore. Right, a veggie wrap. So my husband is seriously not going back to me. Um, as a family, we kind of like just did. We we done had hot dogs yesterday for uh, when we were celebrating Resurrection Day. We done had hot dogs. We've been eating deli meat. But my husband is like, nope, not eating any kind of meat. So, how how do you feel about that though? Like, why are you not eating any more meat? It's nasty. It's nasty, but come on, because I know y'all going to come for him in the comments because y'all seen him eating that soy. It was the soy. It was beyond burger meat. And I think it does have soy in it. So that's just as bad, if not worse, I because it's that, artificial. I wanted, I wanted to taste of a burger, but I usually don't eat those. I think that was the first time since I've been started. Yeah, that was the first time since the show. We haven't had those Beyond Burgers since the summertime when somebody else told us and called us out on them. So we ain't buy no more. But it was other stuff beyond in the in the Beyond Burger that made us think like, why is this thing looking pink like blood? Right, but when we had, for some reason they have not I don't know, that probably was a bad batch. Cause we really? Had, none of them was red. They don't even. Are you serious? Probably was a bad batch. Or oh my goodness! I remember, but I was we Googled it over the summer. We was like, why is the Beyond Meat having red? And they were trying to say it was from. Remember, it was like some vegetable something. Uh, they, See, it's hard to make it because if it's not made out of beans, it's right. made out of beans right. or mush mushrooms. Doing my research, um, I'm trying to get to a place where it's just plant based. Right. That means no eggs. There's no. Right. Um, there's nothing that comes from dairy. Uh, um, An animal. An animal. Right. Which is a little bit more strict, to be completely honest. When you go completely plant-based, is is more strict, but it's more healthy. So, do we need to go to Target? This is right there, I know. Yeah. Yeah, we might do a Target run real quick, y'all. That ain't in his house. Chicken leg, French fries. He high. He's <laughs> now. It's just a little too. It's so hot. I can feel this steam coming off of there. Nah, I want Chick fil A. <laughs> Chick fil A just Chick fil A. It's not Chick fil A, Chick fil A. It's some good waffle fry. Mm. But look, I know. Y'all don't even know what. But it's just a little things. They put my sauce in the plastic bag and didn't just throw them on top of my french fries. Somebody hype. Just in case you was like wondering, is she that type of person? Yes. <laughs> she, there's somebody like yeah. She's that type of person. Like, please don't put the dirty sauce packages that are packaged in some warehouse, and you're gonna throw them right over my French fries that I gotta eat direct. Sorry, y'all. The car is moving. <laughs> that I gotta eat directly in my mouth. Like, thank you. Know. Right, because where else would you eat it? I'm talking. I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat some. Pick play, y'all. Ask us anything, no. This is the time to ask y'all questions. We're here to answer it. In the comments. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my Lord, thank you Jesus for these hot french fries from Chick-fil-A. Thank you for the hands that prepared them. Thank you for this day, Lord. Thank you for allowing us to be productive and do what it is that we needed to do. In Jesus' name we pray, Lord. I thank you for my husband. Amen. Amen. Y'all, I'm eating both, like, oh, both boxes. Right, let me get my French fries, y'all, because he playing him. All right, y'all, we at Ross. I'm thinking about buying some sneakers in here because you know you could resell them on Amazon. Oh, that's a 10. I need two dollars. Every time you sell something, I need two dollars. We are not Come doing that. I need to find me a chair. Spend money. I need to spend money. <laughs> we supposed to be saving yeah. money. <laughs> Listen, I need to find a chair for my makeup desk because well, I have a stool. Well, I think I see what I need. I think I see what I need, y'all. They do not have what I need, guys. It's supposed to be like a gold chair. I seen somebody posted on TikTok that they got a nice gold chair from Ross. Almost like this kind of gold, but it was a chair. And I'm not seeing it. 
I have a stool like that for my makeup and it's, as you can see, it has no back support, guys. <sighs> Don't look like they have what I need. Aww. How to get Antoine a soccer ball for the day. You think he nice. I don't think he better than me though. Definitely probably is. <laughs> Are you ready, sir? To take your tired wife home so we can both get rest. We both about to get rest. We both sleepy. We both tired. You tired? I'm ready. We both sleepy. I got stuff to do. Yeah, I got stuff to do too. Cause I was trying to hold you so I don't fall. Jesus.